morning Capricorn welcome to your today's love reading this is Chelsea thank you so much for subscribing to my channel I really appreciate your love and support and I hope all is well with everyone and Capricorn please bear in mind that this reading will not resonate with each and every one of you time is an illusion in tarot so this reading could resonate with you in the past currently or in the future spirits and angels please show me and pull out your love messages for Capricorn today This is a new deck, by the way, so it's very slippery. Okay, Capricorn, please bear in mind that roles can be reversed in this reading. Could either be you or your person you are thinking about or dealing with. Okay, so we've got the Hierophant in reverse and we've got the King of Swords in reverse. I feel like in the past, somebody could have either lied or cheated and um, this could also mean like somebody could have made promises but did not keep it, okay? So somebody who is not honorable, I feel, um, words to them may have been like easy come, easy go. Um, <laughs> Oh, because the moon is here, so it could be dealing actually with somebody very complicated as well, okay? But then again, roles can be reversed. I feel like you could be dealing with somebody who could be quite troubled and very complicated. And I don't know why. I feel like uh, I'm sensing something in your past, something in your past, um, possibly past trauma since they were really young, okay? There are some secrets here. I feel like... Um, it's almost like someone, it could be you or your person, again, can be reversed, but it could be your person I'm sensing here, <laughs> but then it can be reversed, okay, please bear that in mind, but it's almost like, I wouldn't say it's not their fault, but also at the same time, it was like how they were, how they grew up, I don't know why, I'm sensing it's like something that has been repressed deep down that made this person the way the way they are now okay I'm not making excuses for them but i do sense that okay and with the queen of wands in reverse this could be a secret in regards of passion desire or somebody else okay could be a third party situation they could have somebody else they're keeping quiet whom they're still connected to but the two of swords is in reverse here so mm, I feel like a decision, someone is seeing things clear, clearly now, okay, for what this person, who this person is or the situation, even though, because the moon also could indicate intuition, so I feel like somebody could could be feeling that something is off as well, okay, with this person or with this connection, so seeing things clearly, even though you don't quite have um, the clear answers. I hope that makes sense to you. And with the two of ones here, it's an indication of a choice, okay? I feel like someone could be feeling conflicted at one point in time, but now seeing things clearly. Um, but uh, again, I do sense a complication here, okay? It's almost like I want to see and I've seen it clearly or intuitively, I know, but then at the same time, I'm not 100%. This is why I'm saying that it's like almost like you know, but you're still not 100%. Like, um, I hope it's not making excuses, okay? I hope that's not it, but I do sense that a little bit. And we've got the Three of Cups here as well. This is an indication of either third party situation or reconciliation, uh, celebration, uh, socializing. For some of you, it may mean that someone may want to see you face to face with a page of pentacles or you want to see them face to face. A little bit of an offering here, uh, but as a page is a small offer. <sighs> However, it seems sincere, but I do also at the same time feel that someone could be overly protective of themselves, of their heart with the seven of wands here. And also we've got the strength here, trying to be very patient, deal with the situation as tactfully as possible. You could be dealing with a Leo, could be a Scorpio, Pisces, Cancer, pretty strong Aries. Uh, Sagittarius, again, Leo, um, Libra, Gemini, Aquarius, and the fixed signs can be any sign, okay? But this is your energy, five pentacles, so you could be feeling left out in a cold Capricorn. Um, 
You could be feeling left out in a call or feeling like this person may have treated you unfairly and the sun is in reverse, very unhappy because of whatever that has transpired between the two of you. And also what are not being made clear, I feel like there is no resolution between the two of you or that there is no proper closure. Someone is still left in their head as in like, did I do something wrong or was it me or was it them? Okay, and we've got the chariot here as well, an indication of moving forward victoriously. Perhaps a lot of you are thinking about moving on, moving forward, taking charge of your own destiny um, because you're very unhappy with this person and the situation you are in. But the Wheel of Fortune is here and the strength as well. Capricorn, I feel like this is the message from the spirit, okay, and the universe that, um, that yeah, if you, you should be dealing with this connection um, tactfully. And also be very patient because it does look like your destiny is going to change your fate. Um, well, fate is not going to change. Fate is fate, like it's fated. But at the same time, in tarot reading, we believe in, you know, free will, right? We also have, we also can make our choices. So Wheel of Fortune here, I feel like that means things are going to change for the better for you guys, okay? Luck is going to be on your side. And But first and foremost, you need to, you know, uh, move forward, move on from this connection. Um, but this could also mean somebody could be holding back in regards to wanting to reconcile and wanting to move towards you or you towards them. But the emperor is in reverse. So I do see somebody whom you could be dealing with. Could be you or your person. Again, there's somebody whom likes control, okay? But they don't feel good that they can't control the situation. Um, when it comes to the matters of heart, you know, it's really hard to control. There's an energy, whether it's you or your person, you should know where you stand, but there's somebody whom is unhappy because they can't control you or you, you can't control them or can't control the situation. But somebody is definitely heartbroken and I feel like you are un very unhappy with this person. Two of Pentacles is an upright position. Could have been a juggling. It could also mean a choice, okay, a choices. Because you got 222 here, you can check out your angel number 222. Uh, you can just Google it if you'd like to find out, you know, if there are any hidden messages for you from the angels. And we got the Nine of Cups in reverse. So someone is stressing out. Maybe you're stressing out because this person isn't as sincere or as genuine as what, you know, you thought they were. And it looks like they could be very complicated and they could also be keeping a lot of secrets, perhaps secrets about another person, not always telling you the truth and always, you know, things are always see things always seem very vague and unclear when it comes to this person and it cause it's causing a lot of stress here. All right, Capricorn, um, this is your reading. I hope you resonated. If you did, please hit like, share, and subscribe. Currently, I am accepting personal uh, reading requests. My information is in the description box below. If you'd like to email me only if you want to, uh, only if you're <laughs> serious in wanting a personal reading, uh, please don't email me um, for anything else other than that okay because i've got actually capricorn <laughs> to be honest i don't i'm not trying to offend any one of you but i feel like there are many capricorns actually who, that would email me and demand for this and that it's like why why didn't you why didn't you do my the capricorn reading or you know uh you should do this you should do that or trying to correct me things like that and it's a lot from Capricorn. It's very weird. I, I just noticed that it's always from Capricorn, from Capricorn viewers. Unless, um, unless this has something to do with you asking, wanting to know about the personal reading, please refrain from emailing me and telling me what I'm saying is wrong or trying to correct me or wh whatever it is, okay? I'm doing the best that I can and I can't be entertaining everybody because my time is very limited. Anyway, take care Capricorn. Hope to see you tomorrow as I've been posting a videos almost every single day. If you resonated, please hit like, share, and subscribe. Take care. Bye.